so that won't completely pin my usage. Oh my god. Okay, well, let's see how that goes. Yeah, computer is on overload. Actually, that's a good way to see the chat. <laughs> yeah. That's not bad. I could set up my tablet here. Type onto my tablet. Yeah. That's uh, a good idea. Yeah. Oh, stupid ads. There you are. Hey, okay. Dana, Dana VC. Welcome. Welcome to Zero Page. Uh, so today is it recording? Everything's go. Everything is go. So let's start. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew. Uh, the very first streamy stream <laughs> that we're going to do. This is Darcy, and Hi. I'm James, and we're going to be playing some uh, video games today on the Atari 2600. It's over here. Yeah, you can't see it, but it's there. Um, actually, let's take a look at it. Oh, no, not that. Ah, the crow. There it is. There. There it is, 2600. Six switch, light sixer. There you go. Let's get this back to where we are. Now, I, I apologize for the low frame rate, but uh, my computer is old and needs updating, and it's doing a thousand things at once. Uh, oh, it's Dan I Aya Cavelli. Hello, Dan. Welcome to the show. Oh, there we go. This is awesome, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so if we look down here, it's looking at the chat. Uh, so We're just checking ourselves out to see if we're still pretty. Yeah, we're still not too bad. And it's not the frame rate's not terrible. It's not great. But I do need to upgrade my computer, so it's not like two frames a second. And if we ever freeze, please let us know, even though we can see it over there if we freeze. So we're going to be playing uh, three, three games today. Uh, first one is uh, Super Cobra Arcade. Second one is Ixion. If, what do you think? Ixion? Ixion? Nixion. Nick Ixion. Ixion. There's no N. I know, I was just trying to <laughs> pronounce uh, it. And, uh, never mind. Ixion. Mm -hmm. And the third one, Spies, Spies in, the Night. in the Night. Very exciting. Um, but the first one we're going to do is Super Cobra Arcade. Is that going to work? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be cool. Definitely um, not. <laughs> but let's uh, let's switch over. Uh, oh, I can do it on the keyboard. There we go. So, I've got it on the screen. So these are, I think they're all relatively new games. Uh, this was put out a couple months ago, uh, in November, I think. So very new. Way back in <laughs> 2017. Yeah, way back last last year. When are uh, we gonna get some new games? <laughs> God damn it! Actually, there is. I was hoping a game would come today, um, but it did not come. Is Draconian, and it's made by Daryl Spice Jr., one of my favorite programmers. And it is a 2600 adaption of Bosconian. You probably haven't played it. Um, but I'm a bad we'll nerd. <laughs> we'll do that when it comes, and it should be coming very soon. I saw online some people in Europe got it already, <sighs> just today. So I was hoping, oh, maybe it'll Friggin come today. Europe. I know. But mine is uh, a little bit more special than everyone else's. Um, I got one of my levels, actually one two levels? Anyway, at least one level that I designed in the game. Ah, so, right. I get, so I get a special bonus package with some extra stuff in it. So I think crown. that's yeah, a little crown of glory. <laughs> 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 but uh, So I think I have to wait a little bit longer. I think I get a little statue or something. Oh, that's cool. Which is cool. Um, and I saw Daryl showing his statues off. Of course he gets it first because he made the game. <laughs> he programmed the game. Um, so this, uh, actually let's talk about my setup first here, really quickly. Um, so I've got a, uh, 
Like maybe I can hold it up. No, that's too dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be out of focus, but um, so I've got a, a twenty-six hundred light sixer um, playing the actual cartridge. Uh, we're going to be playing with a Sega Genesis controller um, because it's all around kind of just a general, really decent controller for the twenty-six hundred. And then it is going through uh, my frame meister. I want to change the uh, screen. What? What about it? Oh, oh, that, yeah. Let's go big. Um, thank you. So it's uh, then going through the frame meister, and then out to a uh, capture card, and then out to you guys. So I'm trying to get the highest quality of uh, broadcast. My, either my computer or my capture card is not quite keeping up to pace with the 60 frames a second that the Atari 2600 needs. Um, so it skips some frames now and then, which hopefully won't be too bad for most of the games we're playing today. But if you see some dropouts, then you just have to forgive us for now. And especially forgive us for this terrible low frame rate camera, because it's pretty... It's a get-what-you-get feed. Yeah, you get what you get, it's free. What can you do? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, Super Cobra. Um, this was an arcade game um, back in the day. I'm just going to bring it up on Wikipedia and look it up, because I didn't do my research. <laughs> Beforehand, because <laughs> I just I just filmed an unboxing of all this stuff, so I haven't actually looked into it too much. Um, but for anybody else listening out there, can you tell us how the audio is, and let us know if it uh, is actually decent, or if it sucks, or if it sucks, or if it's too echoey, or it's awesome, or it's too quiet, or too loud, or distorted, or anything. Uh, so Super Cobra was put out in 1981, so it's the right era for the 2600, but I don't think it was, uh, it was a put out for the 2600 back in the day, but I think uh, Champ Games was not too happy with that port, <laughs> <laughs> so they made a new one. Um, do you want to read out the back of it there? The classic arcade game, Super Cobra, comes home through the, the Atari 2600, for real this time. Pilot uh, your helicopter across 10,000 miles of challenging terrain. Vaporize enemy deposits and collect precious fuel to complete your mission. Armed with cannons and bombs, strafe the ground targets and take out airborne enemies. That's strafe the ground targets and take out mm. airborne... I'm sorry. <laughs> Miscommunication there. Yeah. Tanks, guided missiles, falling mines, spinning drones, and homing meteors assault you at every turn. Uh -oh. So maybe you don't turn. Yeah. Invade <laughs> the enemy base and carry away the booty. The booty. So you got to get the booty. So this was made by Champ Games and published by Atari Age, where most of my homebrew stuff comes from. Uh, pretty sure they're the biggest publisher of homebrew 2600 games out there. There's a couple more places that do that. Now, is this... No, because this is going to fall. I need, like, a little shelf here. Oh! Will that work? Is that going to work? No. <laughs> it's right behind <laughs> your hand. How about we move the pillow? Yeah, the pillow has to move because the pillows are awesome. But though, so is that. That's Galaga. We can't have all of the things. No, we can't have all of the things. And the pillows were hidden behind us anyway. Yeah. So, there it is. I mean, it's super tiny now on the little screen. <laughs> so <laughs> I know back in the day, let's let's Which let's day? just start playing. Let's start start playing. Um, so it's gonna start making some noises. Oh, I've got it turned off. Let's turn the audio on, which should have nothing happening right now. Oh, I'm gonna turn that way down. And then you guys can tell me if it sucks or not at that level. I'll turn down a little bit here as well. 
Uh, oh. Does this count as I'm your playing. first? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I didn't die yet, did I? Oh, uh, you did. Yeah. Oh. Uh, you need to play better. Okay. <laughs> Let's reset. Oh, <laughs> cheating already. <laughs> How do I bomb? Uh, you already did. I did once, but I don't know how I did it. <laughs> I'm just shooting. I need to bomb. Down. Down and button. Uh, Old button and down. Up and button. Back and button. No. Nope. If I get low enough? No. Nope. Because I'm going to run out of fuel. Oh, God. Get up there. Duh. Mm. How do I... Oh. Oh. What? Is, what? This what? is a two-button game. This supports two buttons. Oh. That... Oh, my God. That was terrible. I apologize. That was... That's... That was better than I'm going to do. <laughs> but this is... Do I get in unlimited bombs? Yes. Okay. So I'm just going to press both buttons at once now. <laughs> but that's very cool. I know some of these new homebrew games um, support... Oh, oh my. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. oh well, well you got it. some fuel there. <laughs> Does it? Well, I'm, I get a new ship, too. So I wasted it. Yeah. I got it and wasted it. Yeah. I don't know if it registered you getting it, but you, you, you definitely closed with the fuel. <laughs> ah, tank. Um, I know some of these homebrews support uh, two-button games, two-button controllers like the Genesis, so I'm actually very glad that we're actually playing with the Genesis so we can take advantage of that. So, uh, do you get fuel by blowing the fuel up? <laughs> yes. Oh. <It's> very <laughs> strange, but yes. In this game, you blow up the fuel to get the fuel. <laughs> I know some games you pass over fuel, which kind of makes more sense. Are you fueled uh, by righteous uh, rage <laughs> and fury? Yes. And the fuel, you're, you're angry about fuel uh, being in the hands of your enemies? Yes. Yeah, that's it. Right. Um, you're taking away fuel from your enemies because it's obviously their fuel. Yeah. If you look, it's right beside the tanks that are trying to kill you. So it's their fuel. So, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I made it to stage two. Oh. Um, whoa, he's lobbing them. Oh, those are flying up in the air. Uh, yeah, so the lack of them having fuel is a bonus fuel for you. <laughs> it's a, it's a, it's a zero-sum game. <laughs> it's a zero-sum game. <laughs> no there's, fuel for your enemy is fuel for you. <laughs> there's only so much fuel in this land of fuel and missiles. Yeah, and the occasional uh, office tower. <laughs> yes. I guess we're underground. Well... Because we're in caverns some of the time. Yeah. Oh, my God. It's perhaps the subway. Okay, 4170. I'm not going to continue because I'm going to give it over to you. Yeah. Don't worry, oh, you'll yeah. get to play soon enough. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm making stage two. Which is uh, which of the two buttons? So B is normal fire ahead. Mm -hmm. C is drop bomb. And I actually haven't tried A, which might actually be something. Oh! Or for, we're frozen. <laughs> oh, what a lovely way to be frozen. It is a nice, nice freezing <laughs> spot. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> <laughs> so let's uh, get, get us back here. Luckily, I can get us back from just clicking buttons. There we go. Got to tell us when we're frozen. Well, if they did, how would we have known? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we would know. <laughs> I can hear you, not the game. Oh, music sounds before. good. Oh, okay, good. Da read instructions. Yes. We're both going to have a game, and then we're going to read the instructions. Do I press start? Uh, just, there is no start uh, on Atari. Nope, just B to fire. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, um, my, uh, my thumb... It has a band-aid on it. <laughs> That's true. You are so when I die like crippled. that again, it's all the band-aid. It's, it's partly that the world hates me, yeah, and partly that I have a band-aid. <laughs> <laughs> no, you ran right into that one. No, I didn't. <laughs> I ran back into it. <laughs> That's true. You backed into it. No, no, no! You did it again. I, I was trying to get away. <laughs> <laughs> you go at the same speed backwards as the missiles, so I would go forward. Yes. That does seem to be the, the lesson to be learned. Oh, I see. You, uh... Now your fuel goes down. You can only drop two bombs at a oh time. Oh, my. Now your fuel goes down fairly quick. So you do definitely need to... 
to get fuel. You don't have to try to get fuel though. No, That's no, no, you don't. You definitely don't because I haven't tried to do and anything except not die, and, and I still have some fuel. fuel. Yeah, <laughs> you still have tons of fuel. <laughs> fuel's the, it's fuel's not a problem oh. in this game. Game over. Oh yeah, I said you would get your turn again well, soon. You keep playing actually, because that was really short. I'm gonna <laughs> get the instructions play? out. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take a pity play. I'm not proud. I'm proud, <laughs> but not that proud. But not that proud. So, oh. this comes with instructions and a poster. Not helpful. Not helpful. Here's the poster. There's too many things to pay attention to. <laughs> I can't switch what over and see a poster, too. Oh, not you. You don't have to look at a poster. <laughs> well, you got the fuel. Good. Oh. I got that rocket. Yep. You uh, took him out at great just expense. Call me Scud. I mean, Patriot. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> my goodness. Look, it's Band-Aid. It's all over my thumb. <laughs> oh, we're frozen again. No, we're not. No, we're not. We're just not moving. <laughs> okay. Oh, this isn't instructions. Oh, it's oh, a comic book. Oh, no, it is. Oh, it's both. Instructions. Enemy reinforcements have decimated our elite scramble defense forces and devastated our world. They're destroying our world, so we're That's not... That's our fuel! So it's not an invading force. Hmm. Oh, they're invading us. We're not invading them. It's yeah. not like star, Starship Troopers, <laughs> where we're going to kill some bugs on their planet. Carving out massive fortifications 10,000 miles across the surface of our planet. For what nefarious purposes, we can only guess. The enemy defenses are deeply entrenched bristling with artillery, tanks, guided missiles, mines, and flying attack craft. You know, I can tell you from yeah. uh, just playing it a couple of times that that is accurate. <laughs> yes. There were, there were the uh, artillery, tanks, guided missiles, mines, and uh, I didn't see any flying attack craft, except the missiles were flying, and they were yeah. attacking me, and they were craft. Okay. So all of those were there. I don't think we've made it far enough to get to those UFOs. No. At the end of it all lies your goal. Retrieve their their spoils of war. Yeah, we want their <laughs> spoils of war. But that's our stuff. If it's their spoils of war, then yes, they got it from... that's right. It's so they've stolen it. Tricky. we got to get it back. Desperately needed to replenish our depleted forces. Or in a worst case scenario, use it to hire mercenaries to exact cosmic vengeance on our foes. <laughs> Cosmic vengeance. Striking from a hidden secret base at your command is the last remaining squadron of m m our most lethal attack helicopters, the Super Cobras. Unfortunately, <laughs> they're all destroyed now. <laughs> <laughs> they weren't as uh, well, the, lethal. They, they were excellent, but I mean, you shouldn't ask me <laughs> to pilot, pilot them. I've never... Yeah. Yeah. These incredible machines are unmatched in their maneuverability. They're just talking about the machines, not the pilots yet. <laughs> <laughs> and armed with enough firepower to obliterate the enemy forces. I did some of that, even yeah. ineptly. You must battle your way through 11 stages of the enemy defenses, each one featuring a treacherous terrain, a maddening variety of hostile alien, alien threats. You have limited fuel reserves, and you don't want to end up running out in the middle of the enemy's base. Fortunately, the enemy has left fuel depots scattered everywhere and vaporizing them lets you steal their fuel so you're able to suck it up out of the air I was just wondering. think if you could stop you could just take a little sip out of it yeah and you'd fill your tanks but instead you just blow them all up and you get a little you get because li it doesn't fill you up mm -hmm. it gives you a little bit you must pilot your helicopter okay we got that uh, novice standard advanced expert so it depends on you get different number of helicopters. Why am I not playing novice? I'm clearly a novice. <laughs> I think this is standard. So we get four? Or maybe it's advanced. I think we only get three. I don't know. Three. Uh, controls. No, joystick I might up, have four. Joystick up and down cycles through the title page, score table, and score rankings. Uh, oh, this menu controls. Left to right cycles through the skill level. Uh, and select returns the title page and cycles through skill levels. Reset or joystick button starts new game. Controllers, joystick button fires both, both missiles and bombs simultaneously. So that's if you only have one button. <coughs> uh, game button B fires missiles. C Oh, so if you bombs. press A, it drops them both. Instead of oh, pressing... I, I don't know. It Maybe. Says, well, it joystick button. I think that's if you have a, a regular like gamepad. That's a gamepad. Hmm. 
like the Genesis controller. But wouldn't the A be the joystick button? Maybe. Oh, you're right. You pressed A and it did nothing, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's sad. So if you want to simulate that, just press That's what between I was B and C. Yeah. Oh, you can turn on and off the star field. I don't see a star field. Oh, there it is. Let's keep oh. that on. Cool. Oh. Can you guys see it? <laughs> I don't know. Can't tell. Oh yeah, they can. Okay. Uh, pause and re pause and resume. There's a pause. Oh. Oh, it's 7900. No. Oh, oh, oh. Color pause. black and white switch. Let's try that out. Oh, I see. Wow, that is awesome. Most games do not have a pause. <laughs> Just in time. Oh no. Okay. Bonus ship at 10,000 every 50,000 in which every successful capture of the booty. 10 points earned for each parsec. Parsec traveled. I that's, didn't see any parsec. I think that's an in I think that's an incorrect <laughs> usage. No, it's still going up. Okay, it's very short parsecs. Yeah, it is probably a very, <laughs> very incorrect use as your parsec. <laughs> At the end of each stage, you'll be rewarded with extra fuel. Uh, oh, sorry. I'm skipping two lines. Uh, yeah. Uh, each stage is divided into checkpoints. When you lose a helicopter, your next one will start at the nearest checkpoint. On novice and standard, you'll hear a beep at every checkpoint. Okay. After losing all your helicopters, you'll be able to continue uh, your next game at the start of the current stage. You can continue five times. After that, you'll have to start over. Um, then a whole bunch of high scores, and it does save the high score if you have Atari Vox, which I have, but I don't have plugged in. I should get that out for next time. Uh, there are 99 levels. Oh, boy. Okay. Code and design. John Champo. 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 Oh, level generator and code. Daryl Spice Jr. I did not know he had a hand in this. Very cool. We're still not frozen? Yay! <laughs> I think the settings I did help? No, it's frozen since I played yeah. with those settings. Oh, well. Okay. I think that doesn't really give us a lot more information <laughs> than we had before to help defeat them. So we are on standard. Uh, we did learn about the fuel, though, which we already yes. knew, but it's nice to the be... The technical thing yeah. about the fuel? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Do it again. So I'm pressing both buttons at the same time, which does help a lot. And you do only drop two bombs at, at the same time. So Did it say you got a new ship at 10,000 points? 10,000, yeah. We're pretty far from 10,000. Probably at the end of the level you get some bonus. But with the bombs, if you want to like use them strategically, you can't just pre start pressing buttons over and over. Yeah. But... If you're just starting to play, I think it's probably a good strategy to just mash the buttons. So I've got 1,000, so mm, that's pretty fair for getting an extra... Uh, uh. I don't know if the missile hit me or the... Oh, it's making noises now for the bombs. There's probably too many things going on on the screen at the same time to hear the bombs all the time. So I didn't play this game in the arcade, and I don't even think I ever saw this game in the arcade. The fuel thing is very familiar to me. Uh, the having to shoot the fuel to get fuel is something uh, that is very familiar. Yeah, yeah. I think that's a pretty common thing in games. Maybe it is. Yeah, but you may be right. <laughs> I probably saw it. I, I probably saw it, but I mean, I didn't. I definitely did not play it. By, by no means take what I said to mean that I think I saw this game in the arcade. That's not what I mean at all. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just something reminds you. Just that the blowing up fuel to get fuel is familiar. <laughs> ah. um, if you take a look at the scrolling of the screen, the left to right, or right to left, um, it's kind of chunky. Right? I mean, it's totally fine, but uh, the Atari 2600 can, mm -hmm. 
can only scroll that type of play field four pixels at a time. And that's why it kind of goes chunk chunk rather than uh, smooth scrolling. I see. Vertically, it can do it per pixel. Huh. But horizontally, that's why a lot of Atari 2600 games are like vertical scrolling, if anything, right, right. and not horizontal. Right. Or they're static screens. Because mm -hmm. not a lot of 2600 games in general scroll. Yeah. 4790, and I made it to. You made it past the first uh, checkpoint. Yes. But I did not pass the second. So if you had decided to be a big old cheater yes. and continue... Well, it's part of the game. It's not cheating. It's part of the game. If you had decided <laughs> to be a big old cheater and continue, <laughs> yes. you would have continued from the beginning of the second stage. Yes. That's the rule set. Yes. Which is pretty standard for games, I think. And it makes sense, because you can't continue right. Okay. You cut your finger? What was that from? Is that the, still the I same peeled it. one? I peeled my finger. I mean, it was two weeks ago I saw you last. When it was fresh. Right? <laughs> right in the game. Oh, I got some fuel. Much needed fuel. Up, up, up. Down, down, down. Bomb bombs. Do it. Get it. Only bombs. So you're being selective with your button pressings? Yeah, so that I don't uh, embarrass myself as much. Well, actually, but I'm still talking, so I'm still actually, <laughs> not solving that problem. Ah! Well, in this first level, most of the... Oh, right in the, right in the belly button. Uh, you're doing better. A little better, yeah, I am. Most of the things are on the ground in this first level, so bombs are a good strategy. Oh! Stay high, stay forward. Actually, stay back and then go forward. Because they're timed... I think they're... Oh. <laughs> you don't approve of my gameplay, James? Well, you're not dying yet, so... <laughs> it doesn't mean that I'm not playing terribly. <laughs> Now you're doing much better. Oh, oh James! Spoke too early. Oh, I've got one more chopper. We're on standard. <laughs> yeah, four lives. See, the thing about staying low is that the bombs land quicker and you can fire bombs again. That is true. That's why I was staying low. <gasps> you did it! I did it! Level two! A thousand miles. One parsec. <laughs> is that? No, 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 no. That's what they're saying, a parsec. The parsec is... You get ten points for every parsec, and it's going up. Like, a parsec is like five seconds. Oh, so what you're saying is the, the ten miles... I don't thousand, know what that parsec is. is less than a thousand miles. Oh, yeah, way less. Oh, okay. There you go. Six viewers. Oh, my God. <laughs> better than our first radio broadcast. The pressure is on for us <laughs> to get the booty. Yes. <laughs> yeah. How was that? I was like, did we have two? <laughs> <laughs> so, back in the day, way back in the day, in the late 70s, early 80s, did you play an Atari 2600? Did you have an Atari 2600? Me? Yeah. Uh, I had a friend who had one. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Do you remember what games? No. no. I hardly played any. Um, yeah, I didn't have one. We yeah. had a Trash 80. Yeah. We did not have uh, cool consoles. Just, uh, just a computer. And the TRS-80 was from Radio Shack. That's right. The Trash 80. <laughs> TRS-80 color computer. When did you get that? It was the early 80s. Yeah. Um, it would have been shortly after 81. Mm. Uh, 81 or 82. 82 or 83, I guess. Okay. Yeah. That was pretty early. Because my... I didn't have any consoles at all growing up. No. No, I never had I was deprived. <laughs> but not really, because we both had computers. Yeah. Uh, which are actually kind of better in a way 
Um, I definitely felt superior. Yeah. So <laughs> even I. though, <laughs> even though I had way fewer games and the games weren't <laughs> any better, I, st- I felt superior. <laughs> <laughs> um, Sorry, when I say the games weren't any better, what I mean to say is the games were worse. <laughs> <laughs> much, much worse. <laughs> On the Trash 80. There were lots, but, like, I didn't, like, you know, I didn't have that many games. Um, so I had a Commodore 64, and I think I got that in 85. So you had a computer before I did. Yeah, I was superior in that way. <laughs> <laughs> and, but, uh, I'm doing better, though. Yeah, you did really good for a uh, chatty... Uh, uh, <laughs> chatty Cathy? Chatty uh, James. <laughs> um, what? What? That what was guy that? was tricky. That what was tricky. Do? He you waited till I was almost... He was almost off the screen. Like, it's, there. He just shot it's it. It's almost like the missiles are designed to seek out their enemies and destroy them. <laughs> almost. That's cheating. Oh! <laughs> the rules have changed, sir. Yes, they have. Oh, back here? Oh, no. Okay. Just starts you off in a really wide area. Yeah. Gives you a little bit of... A little bit of room. Bomb up! No! Get him, bomb! Damn it. Oh, there's three in a row. Okay, 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 okay. I'm good on fuel, though. Luckily, the fuel is a big old round structure. I think I made it. The color changed. Level three. <laughs> I don't know what that one is in the bottom right corner. I don't know either. I it hasn't changed. It's oh now, now there is. These values. are worth a hundred points each. So get them. <laughs> well, I'm almost at ten thousand. Kind of. A hundred is quite a bit, but they are dodgy, dodgy. Yeah, but you've been getting. Uh, and there's things on the ground. Pretty good on them. Oh, you bombed one of them. <laughs> Nicely done. <gasps> Is it over? No, I almost got 10,000. <sighs> but what I is that? level three. What is that thing on the bottom? I don't know. It's like a, a guy with his mouth open and two little white eyes, or... Yeah, why is it always a red so mouth? And he's blue, but it's always one. It's not the booty, because the booty just was on the screen and had a dollar sign. And it wasn't in the instructions. Oh! What was that? that I, I, you don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> you got to at least make it to level two, because you did before. No, I do not have to. You have to. No. Get that back up there. <laughs> Where's the instructions again? I got to find out what that. No. I know the pain that anyone watching this is feeling because I too have played video games watching uh, watching people play video games that I'm good at and having them just like not be <laughs> not any be. of the good and doing like failing the good. obvious things that you would never do. Yeah. <laughs> I can't over the building. Over the building. Oh! oh, oh. <coughs> you didn't even have a chance oh, I, to run into oh. the building. You can okay, go again. Can no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm reading the, I'm trying to find that thing in the bottom right corner. Oh, I continued by mistake. I'm a cheater! No, it's part of the game. It's okay, because it, uh, I didn't get anywhere, so I'm just <laughs> at the beginning still. That's actually true. <laughs> it's like starting over. It's worse than starting over, because uh, you get all the embarrassment of having cheated, <laughs> but none of the advantage. That's right. You get... Not, uh, whoa, 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 whoa! That was totally was intended. Very close. Yeah. It doesn't tell you what that thing is. It's not your skill level either, because it's a one. I don't know what that oh, box is. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes! <laughs> you made it. <laughs> you made it. So there's like ten. No! What the hell? Ten complete fly throughs. What? Oh, <sighs> proposed. That's okay. I'll fix that. All right, nobody. Nobody's paying attention to what we look at. They're watching all the action. That's true. At least that still <laughs> keeps going. <laughs> oh. The, the shame. <laughs> Honestly, I don't feel that much shame. <laughs> no? No. Nobody's judging you. Well, I'm sure that they are. But I don't <laughs> care. <laughs> if I did, I would have killed myself by now. Okay. Uh-oh, it says I've used 90% of my monthly data already? Are what? You, are you not on the Wi-Fi? I'm, I might not be. <laughs> that is not good. <laughs> oh, no. It's okay. What's today? Oh, it's close to the end of the month. Okay. Maybe it's an actual 
accurate. Oh my god, that was terrible. Oh, oh no. One of our viewers was Tamara. Oh, yay! yay. Hello, Tamara. Is Tamara or was, was Tamara? She's going for a walk. Okay. Bye, Tamara. <clears throat> Have a lovely walk. Oh! It's too late she's gone, but I, if she was still here, I'd warn her not to get lost in the woods like she did that one time. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do it! <laughs> you haven't attached the GPS tracker yet? <laughs> Subversively at night? <laughs> she went through. She went for a walk in the woods. We moved to a new area, and there's this lovely, you know, foresty park. Like, the acres and acres of forest. and But she didn't go into the forest. She stayed on the trail. <laughs> but she kept getting lost in this loop. On the trail? On the trail. Oh, in the loop? <laughs> she kept going. She kept making the wrong decision at this one spot and was just looping. <laughs> There's that rock again. <laughs> How is that rock still here? <laughs> and funny. then we would walk. We would go for the walk, and I'm with her, and then I would stop at the place that she had gotten lost at. And... Oh my, so many times, so, like, we <laughs> went for walks for, like, weeks before she didn't choose the wrong way at the <laughs> same spot every time. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. It makes Dear me, oh my god, it's so good, because if she didn't make stupid mistakes like that, I would feel, like, an idiot beside her, because she's very competent <laughs> in most things. Oh, I knew it. <laughs> so I'll take my wins where I can get them. Yeah. <sighs> Do you guys, like use GPS trackers or anything like on your phone to map your walks or no uh, I oh used to God, that was close. I, I added some of the trails to uh, Google Maps before oh. they cancelled nice. that feature but you can't do that anymore you might be able to but if but they they You'll either like cancelled it or you have to do it in a certain dude. way it's they, they changed it anyways yeah uh, so I remember adding one <clears throat> way back I added a whole bunch uh, but only some of them. I think I did something. I think I did something wrong, like doubled up on trails or something. Maybe that's why they kicked you and out. And it screwed. It screwed up the proper ones because they oh. approved some of them very quickly. But my first ones I did were never approved. Oh. No matter how many times I did them. <laughs> I think the more I did them, the less likely they were to be approved. <laughs> Probably like this guy again. <clears throat> No! Uh, no! If that first missile has got my name written all over it. <laughs> yes, it does. So it's right <coughs> on the side. No! Darcy. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the first missile either. It's like the third <laughs> missile. But still, that you know who you are. Missile. <laughs> missile. No! Whoa. Yes! I mean, I rock! Totally intentional. <laughs> it's a screw. Too many crickets, I mean. Uh, what? 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 You're not making it very far. No, all. I'm not making it very far. I keep dying right in that first area. Keep going. You, gotta <laughs> make it, you have to make it at least to the second level. What? I did before. Every every turn. No, I don't have to. <laughs> don't stop it with your terrible pressures. <laughs> No! Oh. Shot! That's a new, that's a low blow. Uh, that is. Hmm. You can avoid those. I believe in you. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> so when, like, when I met you, you... Did you have your Commodore... No, you didn't have your Commodore no. 64. I got my because Commodore 64 one. exactly as it was too late to have a Commodore 64. <laughs> it made no sense for me to have a Commodore 64 one. No, you played lots of games on it. A little bit, but yeah. it was like I got most of my Commodore 64 play at your house watching you play. Oh, uh, because <laughs> I remember when I met you, we were playing on the TRS-80. What? I don't think we played much TRS-80. Not much, but I remember you loading some stuff up. Oh, yeah, and yeah. Showing yeah. me and... Well, the we Commodore... The Commodore and the TSR-80 were similar in power but the Commodore had a lot more going for it like I think there it were so many uh, games for it and so much pe so many people using it that you just get a lot of value out of that community you know and I, I think it had a bunch of separate dedicated chips 
like a separate chip for the video and a separate chip for the audio. Yeah. And that's why <coughs> I think they're very similar speeds, and you can get... Uh, the TSRA was much more powerful. Oh, was it? Okay. <laughs> 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 or when I say much more, I'm perhaps exaggerating a bit, like but it was, it the was processor. more powerful. The processor. Yep. Just it was apparently sound. a great computer to have if you wanted to program and do, uh -huh. like, computing. Uh -huh. <clears throat> okay. But it didn't have, like, amazing sound or anything like that. Yeah. And once you offload those things, you can clear up the CPU to do a ton yeah. more stuff. Oh. oh, you made it to level two. I did. It was the talking. I think we're frozen. Nope. No. <laughs> it's just that my chin is like this. And I'm like, oh, no! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> You're directing your, sh your plane with, with your chin. <laughs> A common tactic, <laughs> yeah. but not useful. <coughs> oh, oh <coughs> God, that was close. So, if people want to, like, I have a Facebook page, but not a web page yet. <coughs> so, but I redirect zeropagehomebrew.com to the Facebook page right now. So, if you want to join that, if you're watching or listening. Then you'll know when we're going to be broadcasting next, or you can subscribe to this Twitch channel. I don't know a lot about Twitch yet, so yeah, subscribe however you subscribe to it. I know a fair amount about YouTube, but not Twitch yet. I like how the bombs are... are they two colors? Uh, they're multicolor. Yeah. My, my bomb? <coughs> oh yeah. my god. Yeah, your bombs when you drop them... They kind of get very colorful. Uh, they're they're kind of like the. It seems when they come out, like the front is grayish, yeah, and then the back is blue or something. Oh, they're terrible. Well, there's your number of uh, players on the left. Yep. I had not noticed that before. I was oh. too busy dying. <laughs> there were never any ships there for me to notice. So. <laughs> By the time you looked at it, <laughs> which was at the end <laughs> when I had had time to breathe. Ooh, level two. It's a fairly colorful <clears throat> game. The, the palette reminds me of like an apple, like early apple. The um, like that uh, turquoise bluish color, mm. very <clears throat> appley. I will say and this, green. I will say of this game that this is the one of the most, if not the most, playable Atari game <laughs> that I've played. Oh God, yeah. It's, it's it's very like it's got a lot going on. It doesn't have. Like, the graphics are Atari... Well, they're pretty good for Atari graphics, okay. too. They're, they're amazing, amazing for Atari, Atari graphics. <laughs> yeah. But on top of that, like, the gameplay... There's nothing wrong with it. Like, it's... No. Like, it's... It's, there's no it's challenging, and although... It's a little bit mean. <laughs> <laughs> but apart from that, it's... Uh, uh, I think it's a good balance. Yeah. Um, like, <clears throat> it's not easy, but no, it's not no. impossible. I don't think Atari games are typically easy. No, they were really hard. They're meant to be brutal because... Made by a-holes. <laughs> back in the 80s, they were trying to emulate the arcade, which... which <laughs> wanted to take your quarters. Yeah. <clears throat> so, they just went, oh, okay, let's make them as hard at home as we do Also, the they, they were meaningless if they weren't hard because they didn't have... they couldn't make them super deep. No, they just got faster they had, and faster. They, yeah, and they had to be like challenging. Uh, yeah, in the action way. <gasps> Did I get for life ten thousand? Oh my! <clears throat> it's probably I got a lot of these guys this turn around. Because you couldn't like romance the other characters and see if any of them would become your <laughs> pixel boyfriend girlfriends and help you like, in your quests and, games, and help you in your quests and and get horses yeah. to help you travel <clears throat> faster and or have a, a party and have unlimited life with bobbits. <laughs> with bobbits. <laughs> I think I made it, level four. I think you did. <gasps> nice. It's a little. I will say it's a little. It's a little weird that when you get to level four. That oh, there's all a three flashing on the screen. That is weird. They're all scrambling now. Oh my! Oh, That's the challenging part we were talking about. Yes, I did get an extra life though, so I don't think I'll make it to level five. That's the attitude. <laughs> Positive <laughs> you gotta, attitude. You have to. 
You have to limit your expectations, and then you won't be disappointed with life. Oh. No! Okay. 14590. I'm very happy with that. And level four, very happy I am very that. unhappy with it. It seems like a very difficult score for me to beat. <laughs> <laughs> Number one. Actually, it's the only score on the board <laughs> above 10,000. <000. laughs> 10,000 is the minimum score <laughs> before they will even talk to you Which at this game. makes sense. Totally fine. I understand that. I don't. I think they should take <laughs> all of zero, the zero. scores. Zero across the whole thing. Did you go to the arcades much? A uh, little bit. Yeah. Um, Did you play the games in the almost arcades? Almost never. <laughs> See, it's watching. partly it's that I didn't have money, but partly it's just that I I didn't think... Like, I, I, I saw the future. I put a quarter in. <laughs> seconds later, I am one quarter less and still not playing the game. And I had yes. the computer at home, which, which, which right. made me feel as though that was the way to get value. Which it was. Yeah. Um, of course, the games in the arcade were much better. But for a quarter, you got... Like, but here's at the beginning, you suck at the game. Yeah, yeah. And you're putting in a quarter once every minute, almost. Because yeah. Because you suck. So you have to get over that barrier of sucking before <clears throat> you got any value out of it. Yeah. And I didn't have enough money to do that most of the time. Yeah. At most, I think, I would put in $2.00. Maybe, if well, I two dollars was oh my god, two dollars was so much money. No, <laughs> no, 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 never. No, mm -mm. way less. <laughs> <laughs> but that was like maximum. That was maximum. <clears throat> most of the time, I'd have two quarters or something. I think the most I played games was on the ferry, because we have a uh. ferry. Like we're in Vancouver, and we have this huge island beside Vancouver called Vancouver Island. And there's ferries that go back and forth. And they still have arcades, actually. They're, they just got rid of them. They did? Oh. Yeah. Okay. They well, might have them on some of the uh, ferries still, but they're, like, getting rid of it. Um, so they did have yeah. arcades. And I'm sure they don't make any money anymore, but um, the arcades. <laughs> I, just, I just drove into the mountain there. Keep going. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm no, I, happy I'll, with my score. Oh, I see. So you play till you're sick of it. Oh, no, I... Cheated. <laughs> oh, well. I need practice on these higher levels. Oh, you are in the second level. Okay. <laughs> like, I just get through that little... <laughs> it is very narrow. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Actually, I, I want to put it on expert after this and see how much bru more brutal. And then beginner and see how easy it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I have to make, like, micro adjustments. Oh, and continue bombing. And continue bombing and on. <laughs> so much pressure. <laughs> keep bombing, keep bombing. Oh! That was a mistake. Okay. <clears throat> Don't press continue. No. What's it going to say? It's going to say something. Three, two. Oh, that's okay. the thing with the arcade video games. I could go to the arcade. I would. I didn't not go to the arcade. I went all the time. And yeah. I just watched other people play. <laughs> and I got yeah. just as much joy from it. As playing yes. myself. Like, I would go to your house and you would play uh, Ultima. Yeah. And I was playing Ultima, even though I wasn't <laughs> pressing the buttons. You were experiencing. Yeah. Although, the with something like that, it's a lot less. It's like, yeah. it's about the adventure and what have you. So you really, like, it, somebody else can be pressing the buttons and it doesn't really matter. And and we would collaborate on what to do. Yeah, yeah. It's not like, no, I'm not listening to you. Yeah. Um,. Like I would, so you'd get out when I had out my own Commodore. I had Ultima three at home, and I would turn it on, and then I'd just be bored because I was by myself. Oh, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> it is much more fun to play yeah. with other people. Um, we're still hey, we're not frozen. <laughs> the picture is so small that it's it kind of looks tell. like we're not moving. I need to do more of this. <laughs> yeah. So this is on expert. 
I think it's faster moving. Yeah. Oh my and god. They shoot and more. Look like that. You're doing pretty good. Whoa! Yeah, those rockets and they go move quick. a lot yeah, faster. Yeah, the thing is, them moving oh. fast might not be worse for me though because. <laughs> It'll get I, out of the way quick. I run into all the slow rockets. Because <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Actually, no, I, I would die even quicker. But <laughs> I'm just saying. I think them going faster is better. For sure. I think it's just those purple ones that go faster. Yeah, the other ones are still a little, little slow. Little Probably chunky. the other ones were always slower, I guess. This is much harder. So there's lots of room for... Uh, people getting good at this game. If you're really good at it, there's lots of room. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> that was narrow. <laughs> that was like it did say that in the brochure <laughs> that it made the passages uh, <laughs> really narrow. narrow. Yeah. Yes. It made me really not want to play advanced. <laughs> no. I guess I will give it a go. <clears throat> yeah, staying you're low. Really uh, keeps lots of... Oh, so narrow. Keeps lots of bombs um, coming. Yeah. You get refreshed. Yeah, that's a lot the thing. Faster. Yeah. So now I'm going to go on to baby mode. Yeah. Novice. Now I won't play for very long because obviously this is going to be a lot easier than... I won't play it at all because <laughs> it's a lose-lose situation for me. <laughs> <laughs> because if I, if I do poorly on novice, oh, then I, uh, yeah, it's just, just embarrassing. bonus humiliation. Nobody needs that. <laughs> There's a lot of room, definitely. A lot more room. Those rockets don't go any slower. Seems to be a lot more fuel. Things are definitely spaced out. Of course, I'm going from... See, that's not that much wider there. Oh, yeah, but when you have eight blocks, <laughs> <laughs> like three blocks, yeah. eight blocks is a lot wider than five. <laughs> yes. So it's way, way wider there. Yes. Whoa, whoa. It's still, it's still challenging. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So that is good. Super Cobra Arcade. Actually, let's go back to this to make sure. Let's switch to switch to wide, so you can just see us. <clears throat> Put this back in this box. These pillows. Look at those awesome pillows. That is my one of my favorite games. Galaga. It's Galaga there. That's just a bunch of controllers. Out of focus. But it's not auto focus because oh, it's, it's like frozen. a DSLR. Oh, well, it's good to freeze on. <laughs> it's good to freeze on that part. Oh. <clears throat> Does it show that? Oh, what happened? It's like totally... Totally frozen. They can still hear us. But does it show... Um, yes, that's what we're Spaceman? Yep. Oh, that's cool. That is very cool. What is happening? Camera? I think camera. No, still going. We'll reset it. Please hold. Oh, I guess I could have just looked here. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I mean that is delayed, but oh, the program crashed. Yeah. What else should I show? Hmm. Look at my shirt. Nobody can see anything. Oh yeah. Um, <laughs> look at my shirt. <laughs> um, look at this remote control. <laughs> I'm, I'm not getting it. No, <laughs> no, it's not working. <clears throat> it's definitely the program. There is an update to it, so I'll have to try that out. So it's showing that then? No. It says live. <laughs> That's very delayed. Oh yeah, no, I can look over here. I keep, I keep running in loops here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very professional. Oh my goodness. Crashed. Very crashed. <laughs> There's a very crashed yes. level. Super crashed. Super crashed. But we can all we can all appreciate some uh, uh, Tesla <laughs> flying away from Earth 
Yes. And the sounds of our voices. Wow. It's like a radio program. Radio? <laughs> <laughs> oh no. It's like crashed and refused to continue? Yeah. Re re refused to restart? Yep. We're gonna have to go to backup. But that's only for video. We could play video games and that would work. We could, but that's not really the point. The, I'm gonna adjust my all of my uh, business while the camera's <laughs> off. It's a good time to do it. <laughs> <clears throat> Something's going on. There's some technical uh, repairs being made. Ooh, I don't oh. know what that was. Hmm. Maybe that was, was that the problem, do you think? No. <laughs> Definitely not the problem. What we're gonna do... Why don't we put Super Cobra back on <laughs> while you figure that out? That's a good idea. You should have just brought, broke out your expensive camera from the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> no, why can't I? <clears throat> that over. Oh, can. Oh, I know why. No. Well, I'm going to play some Super Cobra. You can't see this, but you'll hear how well I'm doing from the moaning and the crying <laughs> uh, that you hear. Uh, from my voice. Because I am oh, yeah, a big old see. baby. There we go. Okay, at least it's on the screen now. Oh, I was... I was gonna pretend that I was doing well. <laughs> I was gonna try and limit my uh, crying. Oh, well. I made it through the cavern. There we go. Oh, that's a terrible shot. Okay. Let's try and make that better. Angle. Oh, I died. Died. <laughs> died. <laughs> Happens sometimes. It can. Oh. <laughs> I apologize for that one. That was inexcusable. <laughs> it's very bad. There we go. We're back. Oh. We're back. Well, and I died just in time. And the good thing is that we're at super high frame rate. <laughs> and you get a, a novel perspective. You get this uh, <laughs> profile. Deal. Yeah. Because before, all you were seeing was this side as I looked over at the screen like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now it's time for the next game. What is the next game? It's Here, I'll do that. You get the next game. Careful! I'll be careful. Ah. Snap. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't believe me that I would be careful. I could tell. You were watching me like as though I was touching something you hold precious. I do. It is precious. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's exactly how you were looking at me. I knew it. <laughs> <clears throat> next one is... Ix Nixian. <laughs> <laughs> Nixon? Ixion. Ixion. <clears throat> Ixion? Ixion. Oh, oh, wait, no. Oh, yes. The back. Actually, that's, that'll all out of focus. That's it'll work. the back. So back in the day, <laughs> when they couldn't take screenshots other than, like, with a, with a, like, a film camera, they drew... 
the, ga the game. And the back of this one, <coughs> they actually drew it. And With so some funny. computer graphics. Yeah. Oh. oh, and I didn't even open it. You're the bad one. I hate these boxes. <laughs> Those boxes hate you. Always bend them, no matter how careful you are. You always get that. That's that's just that's like a stamp on a on an old golden age uh, comic. Doesn't mm -hmm. count. Like that's. <gasps> I love these ones. Hmm. These are like. Oh, it is Sega. They use Sega. That was because I think. Let's see. Why is it Sega on here? Is it for Sega? <laughs> I think they just bought a bunch of Sega um, games and peeled off the old cartridge labels and put them in here. Because <laughs> I was just about to say, this is like a Sega cartridge, and then it says Sega on the back of it. So Sega used the same cartridges as Atari? Sega made games. For Atari. For Atari. Mm -hmm. And That's this is the cartridge that makes sense, yeah. style they used. <coughs> Hopefully I won't have to adjust the screen. While this goes in. Takes a second for everything to... No, that looks... Oh, it's a little bit over. It's a little bit over. So let's move that a bit. Oh, that's interesting. It doesn't actually update it. And you have to update the uh, now playing. Yeah. Because otherwise it would be unprofessional. We and we would hate to do anything that was unprofessional. That's right. So now we got... Oh, not the now playing. The actual game box art. <coughs> oh, I, there it is. Good. Phew. <laughs> I was like, oh, I didn't get this one. <laughs> There we go. There we go. Super professional. Very nice. Oh, this one's very n cool screen. Yeah, that is cool. It's like a demo. Demo graphics. Ha wow, that's it, really good. How did they have the uh, uh, memory for this? Does the game suck? <laughs> <laughs> no, the <coughs> new new <coughs> games have so much memory. More memory uh, than the old ones. Okay. <coughs> it's divided into like banks of memory, so this would be like one bank just for this screen, and then a different bank of memory for the, <coughs> the next one. So, like back in the day, um, in the you, day, in the day, I gotta find a new phrase. No, you don't. That's <laughs> fine. You keep using that. That is the phrase. Um, when I got when I played games, I didn't have any instructions. Yeah. <laughs> I, I remember. Yeah, because they're all pirated games. What? They're no, we would never steal I, games. I mean, I lost the instructions. They were all borrowed from friends. <laughs> That's right, and they didn't give me the instructions. And so I had to figure out, well, we had to figure out all the games. Like, even in Ultima, I had to write down... I went through the keyboard, pressed all the keys. I was like, oh, that's what that does. I wrote it down. <laughs> yeah. That's what that does. Yeah. And <laughs> for sure, we missed things in games. Yeah. That would have helped us play the games, yeah. um, but uh, <laughs> it was kind of part of the fun <laughs> trying to figure it out. And when I started collecting Atari Twenty Six Hundred games, they were just loose in a big bin at flea markets. Yeah, yeah. Still no instructions. Yeah, um, they don't put instructions in games anymore, of course. But you used to need them. Yeah. Oh, there's two games. Because at the top it says select game. And it says ultra. ultra. Okay, let's see what ultra is. Or Ixion. Mm -hmm. You want to do an ultra first? Yeah, because otherwise you might forget about it. That's true. Because it's not the game. Portland Retro Gaming Expo 2013. That's what that's for. Okay. And there's a little car and little fingers. Snowflakes. Or either race cars that are in a different direction. No. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm the blue guy uh -huh. in the bottom. I can move on the green things, but not... Do you want that blue thing in the middle? Oh, maybe I need <coughs> to collect that. Oh, oh, now I'm moving. I think I have to go collect the other blue things. Oh, okay. Maybe I want the white thing? Oh, yeah. my God. Oh, and they shoot away the places you can go. Oh, that's not good at all. 
and Whoa. something is very bad happening because. Okay, I lost. At the bottom, there's a car and it's racing towards your oh. dudes. Oh, that's a timer. Ah, yeah. Can I make? Oh, I what can did shoot you things. do? What did you do? <laughs> I can shoot things. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! I'm pushing that blue thing around. Yeah. Okay. Well, then I need to. And he makes. He makes paths. Okay. Oh, yes, okay. that makes sense. So I have to go collect the white thing. Okay. Now I'm stuck here, and I don't have access to that blue thing. <gasps> okay, I can shoot the blue thing. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's and it cool. Draw, oh, it destroys and it, it too. Yeah, yeah. But I need my shooter at the same time. Okay, I need this guy to get over here. Oh, you died. Wow. <laughs> this is really cool. <laughs> It's like puzzle and arcade. But the blue thing doesn't collect that dot. I need to do it. Oh. Uh, almost. Now the first level has a lot of paths. So that's not too bad. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Is that here, points, the white thing? Uh, Go get on it. the bottom? No, the white oh. thing. Yeah, I got 3,000. Yep. Those are, those are uh, big points, actually. Yeah. I get points for killing those dudes. Oh, yeah. But not as many as you get for the white thing, I think. No, that's definitely the ultimate goal. Oh, I won. Oh, ultra. I have to spell ultra. Oh my oh. god, what's happening here? Oh, this is like a bonus screen, because there's no bad guys. Oh, okay, I gotta put him down there. Get him and across. And fill the screen as much as you can, I guess. Oh, I don't have much time left. Ah, oh, I see. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. I didn't know what it was going on at first. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. Okay, I need to make a path. I got way too close to that guy. Okay, now it's your turn. Now that we kind of know what's going on. Which button shoots? B. B. Okay. Yeah. The other ones might do something. I haven't pressed it yet, but... So this game I bought just after looking at um, like a YouTube video demo of it. And I thought, oh my god, that looks cool. And I couldn't remember the gameplay at all when I was doing the unboxing. But uh, this is... Oh! What? Shotted. Oh. No, 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 no! <laughs> no! <laughs> I, I didn't... I didn't reasonably well on the first uh, and it lulled me into a false sense of, <laughs> of skill. I had no skill but I thought I did. You can do mass shooting. It has rapid fire but oh. it doesn't really help because <laughs> it'll reset. I guess it helps them sometimes. But you can shoot them directly? You can kind of re you can recall your bullets. Like you don't have to wait for them to go off the screen. Ah, you can just immediately okay. shoot again. I Yeah, I hadn't clued in um, no, actually, I did actually shoot some of those cars. Ah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> actually, I got lots of lots of room to move around now. You only need one more. Get it! Get it! Get it! Get it! Yes! Woohoo! Doing better. Oh, I got to get these things moving. Oh, you have so many points going right now. Actually, it's better to shoot them. These yeah, dudes. it shoots them in weird angles. And yeah. It's the only way to fill the whole screen. Oh god. Okay. A little bit more. A little bit more. Ah! 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 Oh. Better than last time. You got lots. Of, well, yeah, I don't know how many points you had at the end of the last <laughs> round, to be honest. Okay, I gotta get this guy moving. Okay, there we go. There we go. So that's really helpful to, like, ah! Get out of here. To get your little ball. Don't forget you can shoot those guys. Filling up the screen. So you only need to get five each level. Um, yeah, but it becomes, I imagine, more and more difficult to do it. You can't. Sh oh, you can shoot on an angle. Yeah. Okay. You can do it. Get down there. Get him. Get him. Get him. Ah, no, they're. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> One left. 
Oh, that was so, so close. close. That was so close. <laughs> oh. oh, better, better. All right, all right, I'll play one more. Oh my god! <laughs> you got one. Yeah, it's just it better to shoot that guy when he, he bounces around and. Get him! Get him! This guy's oh, deadly. What happened there? I don't know. He wasn't even pointed at you. Oh. Time for the instructions. <laughs> <laughs> they have instructions on that game? Yes. Still happening? Yep. Yay! How's our viewership? Terrible. Terrible. <laughs> There's two people watching. Hello to the two people. <laughs> is you know, it's our first broadcast, not too bad. You are the elite competitor in the Ixion Robot Combat League. Manning the remote controls of a high-tech missile firing speed machine. Your vehicle tears across the floor of an arena, locked in combat with your opponents, but you can't just drive anywhere. There are gaping chasms in the floor. More of the arena can fall away at any time. Worse Still, you're outnumbered. Two to one. Fortunately, you have a special weapon at your disposal. The Kalo Sphere, which not only takes out enemies, but also rebuilds the arena floor, allowing you to span those deadly gaps. During combat rounds, you must drive over glowing targets in order to spell out Ixion, high above the arena floor. If you survive long enough to do that, you enter a special bonus round where you must master the use of the Kalo Spheres. Succeed and you become a legend. Fail and you'll be just another long forgotten footnote in the epic saga of Ixion. Using your controls, the game begins with six vehicular combat robots, VCRs, <laughs> at your disposal. <laughs> Learning to control them is critical to surviving each combat round and moving on to the next. Joystick control your joystick remotely controls your VCR. Moving the joystick left, right, up, and down moves your VCR in that direction. Your VCR cannot move diagonally across the arena grid. Press fire and push any direction, including diagonally, to fire a spread of three missiles. Your missiles will ricochet off the walls and destroy enemy, any enemy they hit, taking out sectors of the floor with them. Neither you nor your opponents can destroy Kalo Spheres. They are indestructible. To control a Kalo Sphere, you must run into it or shoot it with your missiles to propel it around the arena. Once it's in motion, it won't stop until you shoot it or run into it or it runs out of momentum. Momentum. We got all that. Mm -hmm. The object of the game is to destroy your opponent's VCRs while amassing the highest score possible. The screen. You're monitoring the action in the arena looking down from high above. The arena floor is composed of grids of tiles. As enemies are destroyed, the tiles will be destroyed with them, limiting where you can move. The above the arena you can see the words Ixion spelled out as you run uh, your VCR over special glowing targets that appear on the grid. Beneath the arena, you'll see a display readout showing an enemy VCR moving left to right, representing the time in the current level. Left in the current level, we got that. An alarm will sound as the timer runs out. When the enemy reaches your reserve VCRs on the right of the screen, the level ends. Only three of your reserve VCRs can be seen at any time. Okay, yeah. When you're down to your last one, you will see an outline of it instead. At the bottom of your screen is your score. The more you score, the more famous you'll become. Can you rise to the top of the league? Uh, gameplay. Maneuver your VCR around the screen, blasting your opponents. Use the Kalo Spheres to rebuild missing sectors of the arena floor. When you see a glowing target, run over it to collect one of the letters to spell at Ixion. To move on to the bonus round. Uh, this is all kind of redundant. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Combatants. Yeah. Last life indicator. When you're on last life, the reserve VCR will change to an outline. Yeah, it's already said that. Scoring. 200 points per enemy. 1,000 to 5,000 points for each collected letter. Is that first one, second one, I guess? Up to 5,000 for the last one? Makes sense. 50 points per time unit remaining after Ixion spelled. So the ah. faster you do it, the better. Not much points, but it's a little. Bonus rounds, 50 points per restore tile, 10,000 points for restoring at least 104 tiles total, I guess, in all the bonus rounds, because it's definitely nowhere near 104. There's, uh, actually, there's quite a bit. 
Actually, there are quite a bit. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's six by six and five, so eleven by eleven by ten. Okay. Oh yeah, hundred and ten. So you get. Uh, oh, and what? if you get all of the. Oh, okay. So yeah. yeah. So that time you did get ten thousand points. Yes, and fifteen thousand for restoring all one hundred and ten tiles. You earn an extra VCR every hundred thousand points. Seems fair. Uh, want even more great challenge that made the Ixion such a smash heart arcade hit? Oh, this is an arcade game. Ixion Ultra is an enhanced version of Ixion with the difficulty ramped <laughs> up. Oh, we're playing the advanced one. <laughs> For maximum action. Maybe we should go back and play the easier one. <laughs> Choose your battle. At the main title screen, move your joystick between to switch games, press fire to start. You turn to the game screen, press select, and reset switches at the same time. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh... Cool. Then it just shows the difference between the easy one and the hard one. That's why you always play it first and read the instructions later, or you don't get these exciting and fun opportunities to play the wrong uh, version. <laughs> That's right. Okay, let's play the easy one. Just Ixion. Frozen? No. Ah! Oh my god. That was terrible. I want to reset. I wasn't looking at it. I know. All right. Cheaty. This is Sega 1984. Oh, oh, you know what? Pro Sega made the original one, I bet. That's uh, why. That's why it says Sega. So it's not as silly as I thought. Oh, they don't respawn as quick. Oh, this is like... And there's more tiles on the board. This is like so easy. <laughs> oh, let's see how this goes. Probably you probably have more time. I don't do have this. a lot of time. Uh, oh, oh, oh! Get him! Get him! Yeah! <laughs> yes! <laughs> that was awesome. Ah. Okay, so I'm easily excited. <laughs> ah. There we go. There's a path. Shoot that guy! Shoot him! Oops. I forgot. Don't press fire repeatedly. There you go. Uh oh. Yeah, there's so much more time. <laughs> yeah. Wow, like you're gonna get yourself an extra car at this rate. Oh, uh, not at that rate, though. No, not at that rate. It's that. <laughs> Terribleness. Dun, 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 dun. Shoot that thing. Yeah. Ah. Ah, ah, too close. Ah. <laughs> I kept pressing the wrong direction. It kept getting me closer to the enemy. Okay. Kind of just hit them randomly and yeah. You want to shoot them on an angle. Yes, that one I don't. I want to shoot straight on. Oh, what? Uh, come on, come on. No, no. I may not make this one. Oh no. You get a free car though. Woohoo! Hundred thousand. Ooh. Yeah, they're getting a bit quicker now. Not much, but... Oh, tricky guy. So you were trash-talking them, they heard I you. I was. I was like, haha, we'll make them up. <laughs> you're, right, you're right next to you. That's how it goes. The time is not a factor except in this one now. But in the main game, the time is... You get tons of time. Okay. No! Wrong way. Yes. Okay, keep going. No! Oh, that wasn't too bad. No! 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 Get it, get it, get it, get it, get, it. get over, get over. It. Oh! oh. <sighs> Still, you got 10,000. Oh, the enemies are moving. 
a lot faster now. Ugh. There you go. <gasps> Shoot that guy. <laughs> What oh. happened? Oh, I died. <laughs> you died. I'm stuck. Ah. You go in the middle and shoot up. Ah! Oh no. God! Now you're. I can't shoot the ball. Now you are in doo doo. <laughs> I wait. No, they'll bounce off the side. Who will? The, your bullets bounce. They ricochet oh, do once. They? they ricochet once. Okay. At least once. This one is... Oh, my God. Come on. Come on. Can't get an angle on it. Nope. Come on. <gasps> finally. Oh, finally. <laughs> this uh, That was set up very hard. I gotta get rid of these guys. Oh, did you see there's a tail under your door? That's a cat tail. <laughs> I haven't seen that one before. <laughs> That's a rare sighting. Cat tail. Oh, did I... Did I, I didn't win. What happened? How did I advance a level? I think when the time runs out, you don't lose the game. You move on to the next level. Oh. That's, That's On the first one, when you first played, you didn't die. You have your last tank. Okay. Um, you didn't die, but you did get to the second level. And you didn't complete the first level. Oh. Cause oh, I remember I see. Because we didn't even know that you were spelling out the word yet. That's true. And then you did get to the second level, but you didn't get the bonus round. Until uh, you completed the thing, I think. That makes sense. That's very forgiving. Most games, you just, you just die. If you don't complete the level, you lose a man and it starts it over. do it. No, that is not also not how you do it. <laughs> get that dude. Go get your glowy thing. I know. Oh, some right. glitchiness. Not all the bugs are out of this. Why? What happened? Some of the some of the green blocks are kind of freaking out a little bit there. In the fourth column. Ah. But it's very minor doesn't actually affect the game. There you go. Oh, some of them. Yeah. Just a bit more. Yeah! Oh! One more. Come on. You can do it. I can. Oh. He got 10,000 anyway. I'll take it. Nope. Yeah. Got X. You know the game is easier when Darcy gets to the third level. <laughs> 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 oh, the camera turned off. Oh, it doesn't matter, because it's not plugged in. It's supposed to turn off. Which camera? Oh, the original main one. Ah, I see. I think I'll definitely be using the webcam. Takes up less space. And it's faster, because the computer doesn't have to process it. Yeah. And it looks just fine for this purpose. It's about the right, uh, I think right width, I, too. I think I... Run. I think I used uh, what do you call it um, a, a precious life just listening to you talk oh sorry <laughs> well you think I got bonus lives to spare I assure you I do not <laughs> nope no oh head straight for it but that's how I am head straight for the goal what is that uh, no well, at least I got it <laughs> what is that persistent vision is that what that's called when it's like, oh, something's going to kill me. And but I have to get the thing. Yeah. I must have the... That's me. I think it's, I think it's called persistent vision. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, Somebody can correct me. 
Uh, so let's go back to the hard one. Because that's a little too easy for me. Yeah. I know you saw me not sucking too bad. <laughs> it's time to bring on the humiliation. Bring on the pain. <laughs> Actually, could you get that extension, USB extension? Mm -hmm. So I want to move the webcam much further out. So I want to kind of put it on. The you have that one there. No, it's no. already plugged in. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. You don't like it just sort of balanced on your chair? No, it's <laughs> not really the best. <laughs> best uh, spot. Was, it gonna really kind of was the best. Okay, I'm going to just... I, I know that um, people are, are not as interested in... Um, hearing about the webcam as they are and seeing me <laughs> get destroyed in this game. <laughs> no! Oh. There we go. That was oh. someone in a red shirt was in the way. <laughs> I would just like that to go on the record. You can't see him, but he's uh -huh. definitely to blame. It's <laughs> <laughs> not bad. A little bit crooked though. Oh, okay. I think I know why. It's because of the cord. Oh. There. Don't touch it. Actually, that's really good. <laughs> you weren't even looking at the, I was the looking feedback at, of it. No, but I was looking at the where the camera was. That's really good. Yay. It's your turn. Okay. It's on the hard level. It's on the ultra level. Ultra. Can you look this up on Wikipedia, this game? And the ball's different in this one. The ball is... Oh, God. What have I done? <laughs> I know that that's the thing I noticed <laughs> when we were playing the other one, that the ball had, like, more pixels on it in this one. I, yeah. It's a little weird. Uh, um. <clears throat> ball is like a pattern in this one. And the other one is just like a ball. That's really... That's interesting. Yeah. In Greek mythology, Ixion was the king of Lapthus. Okay. Lapithes, What's Lapith? The most ancient tribe of Thelacy, and a son of Ares, or Leontius, or Antion, and Paramile. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All the Greeks. Uh, or the notorious evildoer. Phlegius, <laughs> whose name con connotes fiery. Con connotes. 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 Fiery. Connotes? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Ixian Final Fantasy wi Wiki. No. Ixian Greek Mythology. Ixian Greek Mythology. Ixian Greek Arch Mythology. <laughs> Ixian Arcadian. History. Ancient History <laughs> Encyclopedia. I died. Wikipedia. Arca put in arcade game. Or arcade. That is effective, but much <laughs> less interesting. True. I'm going to play again. Well, you let's play up. Because I died very quickly. <gasps> they, on purpose, like, isolate you. Now I can't do anything. Oh, no, I got it moving. 
Oh my god. Oh, so hard. Yay. Are you still watching mm -hmm, on your mm -hmm. phone? Or is it like logged off now? Wikipedia doesn't is... Know. You look it up over there. It <laughs> doesn't... It is, not, it is resisting my charms. <laughs> Ixion Arcade. I, in uh, Wikipedia, it has Ixion and it has Arcade, but it does not have Ixion Arcade. Um... Mm. Uh, but there's like arcade game history which had it, oh. and there were lots of YouTube videos about it. It could like be that. fairly obscure that nobody is like made one, possibly. No, not even close. Not even close. Yeah, it is close. Oh, you were you were very close. It's getting close. And you got the ten thousand, I think. Uh because you had five of them left and you only needed hundred and four, so you had hundred and five out of hundred and ten. That's true. So many race cars. <laughs> A good strategy is to keep firing because your your bullets bounce off and you never know when or what is gonna hit. And especially with your ball that you're shooting all over the place, mm. because your bullet bullet could just start bouncing, and making these tiles is a very good idea. <laughs> Come on, so close! No. Oh, yeah! Oh. That was close. <laughs> Getting some strategies going now. I gotta get some paths. Yeah! This is still challenging though. I don't think I've got one full. But the goal isn't full. You got one full last time. Remember we high fived. Oh! <laughs> yeah, that's true. Short memory. I'm just so... Not thinking I can get one that I forgot that I did get one. Uh-oh. Oh, this is... Danger, Will Robinson. You can go to the side. Ah! What is... What happened? I thought I just got shot. It's very colorful. It is. Oh. oh. That was my... Think my best game? No. I don't know. It was. was it good. was. It was definitely your best uh, of ultra. Yes. I'm gonna look this up now. Okay, you look it up. I am going to. No, it wasn't an arcade game. No, it is. Oh, it kind of is. Okay. It was an unreleased arcade game. Ah. So Sega had started making it in uh, 1983, but it never got released. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. Seeing it, but it just puts you into the next level, which is very strange. Oh, so it's fine that you don't finish. You just have to survive and not get hit. But you get a lot of points, which you want to get extra lives there for. That's why the numbers go up for each extra letter because it is actually bonus. Yeah.
Nope. I am completing no levels. <laughs> <laughs> levels are for others. Levels are for closers. I'm, I'm not convinced of oh. that. Oh. 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 oh! He trapped you. All right. Okay. Let's move on to the last game. Pop that out. I like this packaging. Yeah, it's just sits except the for top. the top here. You didn't like that part of yeah, it. Yeah, I messed that up. No, you didn't mess it up. But you know what? I'm not buying this to resell it. So, but I don't want it damaged at the same time. But it's only on the top. It's not visible when it's closed, and I pretty much have to. Like, I know that's going to happen with any of these games I buy. Yeah, did it happen with the other one? No, it didn't. Still, <laughs> still beautiful, actually. Yep. Nice. Now this one has the coolest name <laughs> and a cool cover, but I'm not sure what I think of the uh, preview picture on the back. Can you even see that? Oh, 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 oh. It's, it's just it's so dark. You have to pull it back Red here. That camera's terrible. No, it's that you were putting it in front of the lights. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that would do it. It's like... Why can't you see it? It's <laughs> in the dark closet. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Oh. Wait. Sorry, I'm, I'm going to switch to the webcam. I should never. <laughs> should, I, what was I thinking? I, I was skipping steps. I apologize, Internet. Yes. Uh, where is the webcam? What is happening? Oh, this was in front of it. Okay. Ah. Uh. There we go. That's better. Okay, there we go. Now we're full screen. Okay. That'll be easier for them to see. A little bit. Spies in the Night. And this also comes with a lot of goodies inside, which we'll look at. And it also came with X-ray goggles. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Do you use them while you're playing? Ah, uh, you could. But don't. But they're not part of the game. <laughs> they're not part of the game. They, they're not required to play the game. And this actually has the best box of all. La. It is no very good. destruction oh, of the box. So what do we have there? Number 11. I ordered number 11 of... This is actually a limited... Uh, edition version of the box of the game <laughs> as I as I toss it on the ground um, there's a top secret uh, envelope which unfortunately will never be opened because it's sealed or is it we have this on our fridge that exact thing no but we have a million dollars on our fridge it came with a million dollars the United States of America it says Ugh. Uh, getyourmillionshere.com I wanna be rich Silly <laughs> But it's all like spy stuff, right? Actually, let's bring it up there uh, Next thing is I think instructions You wanna open that up? We can't read the instructions before we I try to play the game I know, I wanna see if it's instructions Before we put it aside It is, okay It is. And then a little, little sticker Yep, a little sticker but we won't actually read them yet. Another Either. sticker. Oh, another sticker. So two tiny, tiny little stickers. And the game itself. Spies in the Night. A game as explosive as a bullet from a sniper rifle. So let's pop that in. And this is the back of the box. Very exciting. Yes. Wait for that to boot up. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's exciting. And this Things is are exciting. A uh, noir game. So it's actually a black and white game. What's the timer? Uh, I guess it started, but uh, we'll reset that. <laughs> okay, let's give it a go. You want to go first? Here you go first. I think I've been going first. Oh. Oh. Okay. Spies in the night. Oh, I think you started it.
Now I have played this game. Oh. On um, like the de the uh, early releases of it. Oh. No, you're seen. <laughs> There you go. Nope. <laughs> oh, I see. You have to be in those weird shapes? Yeah, those those are things you're hiding behind, and the thing in the bottom is the shadow. There you go. There you go. Nope. No. Nope. <laughs> Nope. I got rat 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 <laughs> You got shot by the machine gun. Nope. There you go. Oh! Oh, oh there's so there's momentum. <laughs> Is there? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's your excuse. You don't have to duck if you don't need to duck. I think it's always better to duck, I guess. Uh, 15 seconds before something. Explosion. Eight seconds. <laughs> the cat at the door. Point seven seconds. Oh. What happens? What? What? Nothing does. You fail. I failed. What was I trying to do, Start apart from quiet. sneak for a long time? Oh, we'll find out later. Yeah. Your turn. I'll find out. Because the, the lighthouse was moving. Oh, there is momentum. A little bit. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear the plaintive cries of the kitty cat trying to get into the room. <laughs> I don't think so. Yours wasn't flashing. Yeah. Like that. That's when you can't be seen is when it flashes. Okay. I see. It has to be not when it's pointed directly at you. I didn't get that. Sometimes it's flashing, sometimes it's not. It must be like a 60th of a second timing thing that something's not showing up I all the time. I think it's supposed to flash when it points at you. Yes. So it's a oh my god. Oh my god. That's like something Darcy would do. <laughs> I'm so bad at this game. I'm almost there. Are you? Oh, because the lighthouse. Yeah, yeah. Just off it, off it, off it, off it, off it! I think this is the last one. All the way, all the way, all the way! Point four! Oh, you made it! With point four seconds! <laughs> <laughs> point four seconds! I think there was a little thing in the... I didn't get a chance to look at it, but there's something on the yeah, ground there. Yeah, that's a briefcase or something, maybe. Uh, okay. Round two. Is there less time now? More. More time. Maybe more distance to travel? Probably. I don't know, they're just making it easier. Seems unlikely. A lot less big areas to <laughs> to sit in. Yeah, you know, I, I only just got <sighs> I only just got what that you were hiding behind those things. I know you said it, but like I wasn't seeing it. Pillars. Yeah, I wasn't seeing it. I just saw it now. That's funny. <laughs> so touchy. Ra -ta 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 -ta. You press the button. Oh, right. So you don't know. I know, because you don't die that much, so you don't know these things. But what <laughs> happens when you die is you have to press the button. <laughs> oh, big space. Good. Ah! Well, I'm just trying to make it. I don't think I'm going to finish it. I did start out with, with one minute, though. I think it's a lot more time this turn. I don't know. Might make it. Oh, 
Ah, uh, two more. We got quite a bit of time to do the two more. Last one. And there's the door. Yes! Or the Better than last time. No, you get more time. 40 seconds. How yeah. is it you get more time? Uh, because it's harder. Oh, I see. You don't get lives in this game, do you? You just run out of time. Yeah. That seems to be the case. You can clear half the screen in one go. Yeah. Which you need to for... <gasps> but you have to wait <laughs> before moving. Yeah, because um, they shoot you if you don't. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. I think the lighthouse speeds up a bit. Though. Oh, it seems to have. So you can't move quite as much. Yeah. So that makes sense. So it takes more time to clear an area. I don't think I can make that. You can do it! <laughs> doing much, doing better. <laughs> God. <laughs> Risky! <laughs> There's some games that you simply must risk or you shall not win. Yes. Very precision game. It's hard to talk while I'm playing this game. So do you ever... Um, this is the game, right? This the, is all of the game? This is the game, yeah. Okay. I thought maybe it was like Aliens, where this was the first level. <laughs> I think. And then you make it to... Um, like you know, another scene. Yeah, yeah. I think this is just the game. I'm like, sure it is, yeah. Better every turn. I'm sure there's going to be a breaking point where the... Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, it's much worse now. But I have more time. It is faster, the... Yeah, a whoop whoop. Yeah. <laughs> it does seem like there's momentum, <laughs> like you slide there's into a place. There's touch of momentum. Oh, I should have kept going. Oh. So you kind of have to stop just <laughs> before it. <laughs> You got shot in your face, sucker. <laughs> oh. And again, that time you got but shot you, in the toe. You, there's no penalty, though. Yeah, the it penalty is that restarted. all the time you used going across, you have to start that level over again. So there's not much of a penalty. Oh, I didn't duck. Yeah, not no penalty at the beginning. Yeah. Which is, I guess, kind of good. <gasps> uh oh. They're, they're getting to use a lot of their bullets in this particular round. Definitely are. <laughs> There's no score in this game, and it doesn't tell you what level you're on. Uh, you do get it? a score. Oh, okay. I got 400. Oh. It shows you so time. I don't know if you've beaten 400 points <laughs> or not, James. I don't know. We'll have to see. Um, we'll see. <laughs> see whether or not you've exceeded my score. And I guess it's how much time you have left at the end of each round hmm. for score. It must be. That's all that there is for it. My watch thinks that I should do some exercise. I think no. <laughs> Does it tell you what type of exercise you want? It gives me a choice of squats or torso twists. Torso twists. Or ah, ah you can't move while you're squatting. 
Lifting up. Lifting up. Something like that, yeah. I guess depending on your environment. It's always somewhere embarrassing. <laughs> it never tells me to do squats when I'm at home, like in the privacy of my own house. So it's like, oh, you're in a grocery store. I think you should do some squats. <laughs> Coffee shop? Squat time. I don't think I'm going to make it. Oh, no, doing stuff like that. Oh, not even. Come on. Last level if no, it's not enough time. Not when you stop short like that. Go. <laughs> I have to go for it. I, I have to. I know. So does it just sit on the screen? It will sit there forever until you press the button. Yeah. And I believe you pressed the button again because you ran out of time. Oh, so now, right. It didn't seem like much because it was but only 0.2 of a second, so but... I had time to try again. Yes. There it is. 33900. Three, yeah. No, it's, it's all right. You, you can say it again. <laughs> <laughs> Spies in the night. Well, hello there. My name is Starling. Ray Starling. I love, the sound, I love sounding all James Bondy. I'm here to tell you a little secret. I have an odd job. By odd job, I mean I kill people and blow things up. Now, killing people for money is frowned upon, and anyone with any common sense would turn their backs on it. For me, this job, this job, is my crowning moment. How many people can say that the President of the United States handpicked you for your unique resume? You see, there are a bunch of bad guys in a military base doing bad things to good people, some good people. I'm going to stop them. Here's my plan. One I hope you agree with. So listen up and let me tell you. <laughs> Don't try to adjust the color black and white switch on your 2600. This is a noir game. <laughs> <laughs> Gameplay. You're a spy in a trench coat and fedora trying to infiltrate and destroy the target base. But there is a rotating lighthouse in the distance. If the beam falls on upon you and you aren't completely hidden behind the wall, a sniper will end your life in a hail of bullets. You must destroy that lighthouse first. Push the joystick left and right to walk in that direction. The fire button will make your player duck. This is helpful to hide behind shorter segments of the broken wall. Cross to the right side of the screen to move to the next section. The broken wall is randomly generated each time. Once you pass a certain number of screens, the level will advance and the wall sections will become more sparse. There's no limit to the number of lives you have. If you die, just press the fire button to try again from the left side of the screen. There's a timer that counts down each level. Try not to get shot as it will waste some time. Make it to the end of the level with time to spare and you can blow up the lighthouse. Beware, in later levels, the guards will actively fire at you from the sides. Hmm. Yeah, I guess you have to duck then, maybe. Hmm. I don't know what that quite means. Because you you get hit if you're standing up on the first level. If the flashing screen bothers you, this game flashes the background once every three seconds or so as the lighthouse beam passes over the player. If you want to turn off the flashing, set the right difficulty switch to A. Well, we have it on B, so that's mm -hmm. the normal, I guess, mode. Player, lighthouse, wall sections, time remaining. Game program by Jared Gray West. Artwork by DC Stulpner. Cartridge service provided by Atari Age, produced and released by Neo Games slash Scott Dayton. Scott Dayton runs the Atari Homebrew and Hacks Facebook page. And he is very awesome. And uh, so this was put out by Atari Age as well. All three of them. So if they think that your game is going to do pretty well, they um, let you publish it on their website. And um, so you, they usually only sell really, really uh, decent games. Yeah, I don't, dossier. <laughs> I don't know what's in this. Uh, I don't think you have clearance for that, sir. <laughs> so Apparently top not. secret. And I only have this much level, not this much. <laughs> oh, this. I was going to show you this. Camera. Oh. It's in oh. big. It's in small. Oh, uh, yeah. We'll switch over. Because this is not very big. <laughs> no. <laughs> so... I've had this for since probably the late 90s and I've always wondered what it was 
because you look at it, when I bought it, it was like, I, I used to buy anything that was remotely to do with Atari because this was 99 cents because <laughs> it was super cheap back in the late 90s like everybody was actively getting rid of it like out of their basements and yeah yeah it was worth nothing yeah so i bought everything i didn't have already um and i bought it and i was like okay it's got a button how am i going to play a game with just a button and i thought maybe it's for a very special game where you have one one hands on the joystick and this is like your second fire button and I thought oh that's that would work that mm -hmm. makes sense you know for a flight sim you can bomb yeah, or yeah. something because some some games do use the second joystick not many right right for for extra stuff um, and then a couple days ago uh, where did I see it? it's on some YouTube channel uh, them talking about this and um, let's see if you can guess what this is and what it's for Is it for the handle of a bicycle and then you have this for your bell? <laughs> no. 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 Is it for a game where you have your suicide bomber? <laughs> suicide bomber game? That would be the right joystick for it. Uh, no. Is it for a trivia game where you have to press the button be first and answer the question? That is a that's a that would be awesome. And you could have four of them and it would have a splitter, but no. Is I'll it like you do you do this? Uh, or am I just breaking it? You're breaking it. Okay. And don't uh, break it because it's very valuable now. <laughs> um, <laughs> I thought it was worth nothing. It was in 97. Yeah. Um, I'll give you a hint. It's the first of its kind ever made. First type of joystick of its kind. Is it like a like a accelerometer? Kind of. And like, is it like sort of like a Wii game situation? Yes, it oh, is. That is very cool. It's the first motion control joystick ever made. What's inside is mercury. Oh. This is it illegal to ship in the mail. There's a lot of mercury in this. <laughs> um, so when you tilt it, the mercury activates switches inside. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. So let's try it out. I don't know if this is the right game for it, but we'll give it a try. It's this would be a fairly simple game to because it's just kind of left and right. There's no up and down in this one, so won't be too bad of a game to try it out on. <coughs> Let's switch back over here. Oh, oh, I'm gonna do it. Yes. Oh, oh. predictably, oh. I have been there shot. <laughs> <laughs> so no. can you see? Yep, you can see it on the webcam. Good. <laughs> Smaller movements. <laughs> Actually, this is a really good joystick for this game because it's just tilting and the button. There's no. <laughs> Sorry, what were you saying? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Can you pull down to duck too? Is that? I don't think so. Because you're like f flipping out a bit there. Well, that's just me. Oh no, you can't. Okay. <laughs> I'm very frightened. Oh, <laughs> uh, so close. <laughs> there you go. So how was it working? All right. <laughs> I'm just holding it in one direction, and I press the button when I want to stop. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. That's probably a good tactic. Does that work? Yeah. You know what? <laughs> that is probably the best way to play this game. I don't know. Unless you want it. Unless you went overshot it, and you need to move back. But if you're p precise in your movement, that would totally work. <laughs> Two seconds to get three screens. One. What I didn't realize. Zero. What I didn't realize is that the <clears throat> when you restart, I thought that the why I died a couple times there is because I thought, oh, 
it's pointed right at me, so when I start, it'll I'll have the whole thing. But it starts at a random spot or a different spot when you start again. It's not. Does it? It's not starting from right where you were. Okay, I'm gonna. I got 400 again. <laughs> <laughs> Very consistent. Okay, get shot. Okay. So it's right on you. Well, yeah, of course, it's, it's always right gonna be you. right on you. Oh, well, that makes sense. Yeah. Okay. So that's, that's why, why I got, that's why I got shot multiple times. Is I was not looking at it. I was making assumptions, and so a couple of times I was like, "What the hell? <laughs> How did it get around so quick? I just started." That's. Uh, I'm sticking to that story. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is this works really well. It has a slight slide when you stop. Mm -hmm. You just have to make sure you hold down the button when you start the level. So you don't just run right into gun yeah. gunfire. Yeah. I don't know what it's talking about when they say it shoots from the sides. I think people come from the side and shoot at you and you have to duck. Oh, on higher, much higher levels, yeah. I'm guessing. Yeah. Oh, I see. So there's even more. Like, oh, they appear... And then you have to, like, duck. Okay. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. Good. I think we're done with that one. Yeah. So. There we go. Spies in the Night. Very simple. I mean, there's not much to it. But, um... It's, it's pretty fun. It's pretty nice. What do we? What? What do you want to look at? I thought you oh, were trying to find that. I was that. trying to find that. <laughs> <laughs> trying to find the the bottom in the top, but it wasn't there. The bottom's in the bottom. This is not flat. I don't know why. Hmm. Something wrong with this? No. That's not right. Maybe it does poke out. Careful, careful, careful. Oh, your card was... I think you're good, though. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't go completely flat. Well, luckily, you have that plastic thing to hold it. Ah, yes. Excellent. So, which one did you like the best? Super Cobra. Yeah? Yeah. I, um... I Ixian like was neat, too. Yeah, Ixian was, was really fun. Yeah. Because um, it, it had more than one thing going on at once. Yeah. Because you had to control the ball. You had to watch out for the... The guy's shooting you. You had to shoot them. You had to go collect the guy. There's yeah. things falling off. Yeah, it was cool, but yeah. it, that doesn't compare to <laughs> a scroller where, no. like, there's like seemingly limitless new things coming up. Yeah, it's much, much more variety. And variety. helps. It's good for your uh, hill climbing and <laughs> cardio. <laughs> yes. To do the if that counted. Yeah. Maybe if you moved your watch up and down yeah. while you're playing, it would count for exercise. <laughs> and um, spies in the night. It was cool, cool concept. Yep. Um, very limited gameplay. Like, yep. there's just that. Yeah. Running and ducking. Yep. Over and over forever. I guess once you get to the higher levels, there's guys shoot on the side, but it would. If you have to do, if you have to get to high levels before you get just that tiny bit added, then yeah. it, maybe it should come sooner. Because I think I got to level three or four, and they still weren't there. You. At least three. I did it twice. Yeah, you you were on level four, at least. Okay, yeah. Because yeah. you had two minutes at the end. Yeah. And it gave you 20 seconds oh. each bonus. So the first three levels got you to the level where you had two minutes. You yeah. started at one. Yeah. So I think it probably should have come in a little bit sooner. The guy shooting on the side. Because didn't, it didn't talk about any kind of level select, like hard difficulty or anything. But uh, that was pretty fun. Um... Yeah, so thanks for joining us um, for our little Let's Play. Uh, I don't know how often we'll do these. Uh, might be Darcy next time. Might be somebody else. Might be someone who can play games. <laughs> <laughs> you just have to enjoy the games. Yeah. Don't have to be good at yeah, them. It's true. Um, might even be my wife. She's expressed some interest in it. That'll be much easier to arrange. Darcy lives a little bit of a distance of time but uh, you come over every Friday or so every second, every second Friday, Friday. Yeah. so we'll try and take advantage of that and I've got a ton more games homebrew games these are all the ones I did in the unboxing ah. the other day 
which is not posted so don't go looking around for it I'll, i have to edit that it'll be out probably in late march because i want to make you know graphics and stuff and all that and then all these 2600 games are all no. homebrew as well so there's lots and all those up there too <laughs> so there's probably 30 or more games um, for the 2600 at least that's my primary actually I'll just show this off to you because this might be interest of you as well because um, I haven't bought anything other than 2600 homebrew except for this one which I got as well I did in the unboxing C64. for the Commodore 64 it is Galencia nice which is Galaga a, a clone of Galaga but it's they kind of remade it a bit as yeah, well yeah yeah um, because Galaga was never officially really released for the C64, which was like a, a crime. Really oh, it's amazing gameplay. Mm -hmm. It's got like... It, it is different gameplay and different patterns and different bosses and stuff and, and really good um, really good music and everything. So, um, And I do have an S video out for the C64. I have an upgraded output. And the... Uh, Framemeister does take S video. It takes everything. So maybe at some point we'll play yeah, this. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Um, I mean, <laughs> I will be terrible at it. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. There's a cattail under your. Look, uh, why would they stick their tail under the. Here's a cattail. We're done anyway, so I'm going to show you the cattail. <laughs> if you can see it, I don't know, it's in the dark a bit. It was. It was it was even in further See a before. Cat tail? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that hey, that's pretty, pretty good. good. A little bit of an angle, but crooked, that's but okay. That's okay. We're still streaming. Excellent. So that held. The streaming held the whole time. It was just that that camera setup. Mm -hmm. I think it's my capture setup. It's really slow, and let's use a webcam because this looks really good. Yeah, like totally fine. I'm really good, actually. And especially, it's mostly going to be that little box in the corner anyway, so... Yeah, it'll mostly look like that. Yeah. So, oh, I didn't change the graphic. <gasps> okay, we're going to have to pretend that we didn't play that game, and we'll go back. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. And we'll play that again. Or... <laughs> well, we won't play it again, but we'll... Uh... Here we go. Professional. That's right. There. There you go. Spies in the night. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta remember that next time. But anyway, we got we got that up. Because I made that graphic. Well, I didn't make it, but I cut it out and made it nice. Uh, let's go back to the webcam. Thanks for joining us. Um, so you can join us on Twitch, because uh, I'm probably going to post this on YouTube, maybe. Um, the the recorded version of this. Um, our, the Twitch channel is uh, Zero Page Homebrew on Twitch. Just search for that um, all together, of course. And uh, the website is zeropagehomebrew.com, which now, right now redirects you to um, just the Facebook page where I post and stuff, but eventually it'll have a website of homebrew that I have and homebrew that I want to get. Um, and uh, yeah, so upcoming stuff will be reviews, more Let's Plays, some hardware kind of reviews. Not not really specifically this, but things that are related to like new new hardware that's come out because um, you know everybody's reviewed to death old stuff. Um, probably some programming uh, information as well about homebrews, how to make a homebrew game. Um, of course, I'll have to stay ahead of how to make a homebrew game by making a homebrew game myself, and I have never made one, so I'll be learning alongside you guys out there. So that's kind of uh, a good way for me to force myself to learn, but uh, that'll be taking place throughout the year. But um, so, thank you for joining me today, and you guys out there, and we'll see you next time. Bye! How do you think they keep the mercury in this thing? <laughs> like, get it or keep it in there? Keep it in there, like, slippery stuff. <laughs> I don't know.